Okay, so um, we, I thought we'd switch it up a little bit. And uh, by that, I mean going back to uh, where we've done Instagram and sermons uh, a fair bit in the past, back here in the woods uh, by the stream. You can probably hear it gurgling in the background. Um, I think the last time we filmed here was over a year ago. And, you know, a lot has happened in that year. Um, COVID has continued on. And, uh, you know, I, I marvel at how much has changed during that time. Uh, if you think back, we entered into COVID with that sense of adventure and, you know, we're all in this together. And then it sort of, I don't know, it, it, uh, it waned and, uh, you know, it dragged on and you could tell uh, the enthusiasm, the, the togetherness uh, started to wane. Um, you know, for the church in North America, for the church in Canada, this has been a bit of a rough ride. Uh, we have wrestled with division. We've wrestled with, um, you know, differing opinions and, you know, how we respond to vaccines and everything else. Um, but, you know, one thing that hasn't changed, and, and I love this about our God, is his faithfulness. Um, you know, last year, uh, around Thanksgiving, uh, one of the things that I look forward to in the fall is the, the brook trout coming up to spawn in our stream. And um, they were here, and, uh, you know, it was just amazing to take in. Um, this year, they didn't seem to be around that much, and uh, I was afraid I'd missed it. Um, so here it is now in November, and I was actually uh, really just super pleased uh, to see them just the other day. And, and I know, I get it, it's a small thing. But you know, our God demonstrates faithfulness in ways that um, we may consider small. And I think that's, that's a miss on our part. Um, I think God knew I needed some encouragement, uh, a, a gift, if you will. And seeing the brook trout was just absolutely perfect. Even as we're filming this, I can see them uh, swimming up and down here. And it's just a reminder to me that in spite of all of the change and, and all of the struggles that we might have, and how our faith at times can wane and we can wrestle with our commitments to the church or our maybe even our commitments to our Savior. But God does not change. You know, I love in his word how it says, even if we are, you know, if we lack faith, he will not uh, change. He will not be uh, unfaithful he will remain and let me encourage you in that you know God is waiting beckoning for each of us and I love the fact that in spite of all of what's taken place over this last year uh, you know the the challenge uh, the dryness at times spiritually the um, the negative attitudes and, and different things that emerged, in spite of all of that, God is good and he is faithful. And he beckons us to discover him again. Let me encourage you to do that. We're gonna be uh, celebrating communion on November the 14th, this coming Sunday. And we're gonna be talking about the promises of God. And let me encourage you, be a part of that time. Join with us. Uh, and let's discover again just how faithful and amazing our God is. Looking forward to seeing you. Take care.